hiya! Welcome to our channel! Bentley here has decided that he doesn't want to stay on the farm anymore. He has been running away every time he gets let off of his collar in the morning and he doesn't want to listen. He goes into the neighbor's yard, just runs laps, looks at us, hears us whistle, and just runs the opposite direction. So I think we need to figure out how we're gonna tame this young stallion because he doesn't like listening, does he? That's okay though. Sir, this is the stall that our goats Nanny and Franny enjoy. So we figured he could be their little protector and their buddy, basically be a goat nowadays. So that's his new job. Outside, we'll go ahead and show you, is a six foot chain link fence with a chain link gate that's also six by six. And so far, so good, no escapes. <laughs> Finley so-so. Happy some days, happy not times. I think he's he likes getting wet and being dirty, but I think the goats aren't the best company. Huh, what do you think? Are the goats good company for you? Hmm. Do you like living out here, Bentley? Do you like your yard? What about the goat goats? Oh, he said one's right there. I'm keeping track. What about Franny? Franny's a little standoffish. We let Franny out this morning because she was ready to run through the rain to get into the other stall, which tells me she didn't like sleeping with Bentley. We didn't use all of the things that we bought from Home Depot, but we ended up buying two 50 foot rolls of the six foot um, fencing, and those were $109 a piece. We used about one and a quarter of them. So whatever that cost is and then t-post we decided to buy 12 we only ended up using one two three four five six six of them um they're seven bucks a piece and then we bought this six foot gate love this thing it's adjustable but the six by six foot gate is 109 dollars also in our area didn't take long to put together we just used the t-post clamps that you can get for normal horse fencing and it took about a day it really wasn't too hard and Bentley just seems to be totally respecting it. So, when in doubt, get some chain link fencing. Puppy, a real farm dog. I'm so proud of you. You're such a good boy. Such a good boy. Yeah. Good boy, B. We're gonna make it even better as time goes on. You ready for your dog house? I wanna get in your nice doggy house. I would say the hardest part of this whole process with leaving B out here is him wanting to come with us. So as we just started to kind of grab our stuff and start to walk towards the door, he instantly kind of pranced over like, take me with you guys. And you feel bad because we love Bentley and we wanna let him go with us if he wants to come with us, but it's good for him because this is really what he's meant to do is take care of the goats and take care of the chickens. And it's good for us because you don't wanna know what Great Pyrenees hair does to your living room. It's atrocious. And he is happy out here. He's not shivering. I'm shivering and I'm in multiple layers and he is chilling right now. Super chilling. 